my gorgeous spiky scrumptious tasty juicy scipio welcome to your love tarot reading let's see what card is oh little card came through five of uh five of five of swords five of cups but boom someone's feeling a little sad it's okay baby the it's dark as before the dawn it's gonna be okay with you let's see why we're feeling sad okay Scorpio, this is going to be for Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Oh my God, everything's fallen down. The energy today, Scorpio, is something has fallen down to the ground, baby. But it's okay, boo boo. You're picking yourself up. This is that Scorpio energy. You know what, baby? Scorpio to Scorpio and Scorpio, Sun, and Rising. Let it burn. This isn't even the reading yet. It's just like whatever. Let it burn. Whatever it was, baby. Whatever fell down to the ground. Whatever made you sad. Let it burn, because that's the scoopy way. Okay, now, now I'm just sounding like uh, like a crazy life coach. Okay, all right, boo boo. Uh, this is for scoopy. Uh, without further ado, look, full moon, Mercury retrograde today, everything going on. This is for scoopy, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. And we're going to take a look at your general energies and love, boo boo. Uh, this is what new fishies are swimming at you in the sea of love. Okay. Who's in, who's out this season, who's getting deleted from the database, and who is that new little himbo bimbo, anyone in between uh, you're going to meet on Tinder on a Tuesday, who is the lucky little boo boo. Okay, let's see. Is it your soulmate as well? Okay. Oh, my God. The high priestess. All these cards. They just want to talk to you direct. Like, should I just, like, leave this video now? All right, boo boo. Like, what is going on but they do want to talk to you scorpio um but boo, someone wants to say that it's you know whatever happened um in the past with love whatever has been happening the thing that's cra uh, crashing down to the ground um but boo, it's okay like it, it's all part of the wisdom part of the lesson you are way stronger than you think but boo, scorpio this is saying prevail prevail scorpio way keep yourself to yourself go within there are answers within to the quandary that you are experiencing right now. Wow, these, <laughs> these messages are really mystical coming out today on this beautiful full moon. Okay, let's see. Please show me angels what's happening here. Also, Scorpio, if you are new to the channel, welcome to Blue Angel Love Tarot. And if you are a returning Blue Angel, thank you. I appreciate you. I love you. Give me a kiss. Mm, I see you, baby. Give me another kiss. Mm, and I just love, love, love you so much. One more time. Mm, Scorpio, I missed you. <coughs> oh, my God. Give me one sec. I'm so sorry. This is mo the most Mercury retrograde session we've had ever. Uh, I just did Aquarius. We had like the camera stopped midway. I really feel the Mercury retrograde uh, energies. I already broke a couple of things, Blo broke something in myself, pulled a muscle. <laughs> like, you know, I just like, I've just been breaking stuff since yesterday. It's just been so potent. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry. Now I'm just like, <coughs> can't talk. I, I do apologize, baby. What was I saying? What was I saying? I need to reshuffle the cards. The energy is just too strong. Uh, boo -boo, I was just saying uh, welcome back to Blue Angel Love Tarot. If you are a Blue Angel boo -boo, already, I appreciate you. I'm a Scorpio Sun and Rising. The energies are crazy in the readings today, and I love I love that for us. Uh, also, boo -boo, I'm sorry. Mommy's been neglecting you. Okay. Give me another kiss. Mm, yeah, it is kind of weird, isn't it? Mm, but I kind of like it. Anyway, boo -boo, uh, Mommy's been neglecting you because I've been away doing some magic. All right. I can't really talk about it, but I've been doing goddess business. So I have been doing the goddess business, the business of the goddess. So uh, I'm just, you know, um, and I missed one. So we're going to do two today. We're getting a one general, one you versus them and the same tomorrow. And then we're going to do loads of bonuses throughout the month to make up for all the uh, little ones we missed because I love to see you every day, boo boo. I need you. I love you. Mm. Okay, skip you. Okay, mommy's getting a little bit mushy here. Mm. Is it weird that I'm calling myself if you're a mommy, I'm doing that today. I would say this is the choices. I woke up this morning and I chose violence, all right? So today I'm your mommy. Let's see, boo -boo. <laughs> Oh my God. Okay, let's see what's going on for Scorpio. This is just going on too long. Okay, the cards are just crazy. Scorpio, I don't, am I, should I even post this video? I feel like I've lost you already as an audience because like it's just the cards are crazy. Show me what's going on for Scorpio, boo, -boo. Why is it so crazy? <gasps> oh, wowzers. Wow, Mercury retrograde, Scorpio. You cannot make this up. You are getting rid of something. That's the thing that came crashing down. Okay, we need to post this, even though it's kind of chaotic. I do apologize, but look, this is important for you, Scorpio. Oh, my darling baby, you're, 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 you're getting over something, okay? You're getting over someone, Queen of Swords, but you had to cut it off. This is your present energy. The Ace of Swords and the Queen of Swords, like you, you had to do a snippity snip snip, okay? And it could have been super painful for you. It was super painful. 
Scorpio, I feel like you've been on a journey for love. You've been seeking love, okay? You've been seeking true soulmate love. This is the Scorpio way, the Scorpio soul. Uh, since your youth, this is the Page of Pentacles here, admiring this beautiful pentacle, this dream, this manifestation that they're trying to uh, materialize. This is you on your quest for love. Wow, sirens again. You know what? We've been hearing sirens all day long, me doing the readings today. I do feel like, you know, that full moon, on her, it's the full moon tonight, super potent already, baby. Uh, I've, this should have taken me two hours making all the videos and like it's just taking me the whole day like mercury retrograde full moon everything but look this is your youth since you were a child maybe not a child but maybe even a child like you know maybe you were reading fairy tales knowing that someone special is going to come into your life you know prince princess anyone in between but certainly since your youth maybe your early 20s like you just felt like you knew that there was a soulmate out there for you like the one the true one you've been on a quest Baby, you've been on a quest to find that person. Maybe you've had some false soulmates on, on the way. Maybe you've even had children with someone who turned out not to be the person for you. And that's okay. Uh, there's beauty in children. You know, obviously that's okay. I mean, why, why didn't I even say that? But maybe maybe someone feels regret. They're like, oh, I wish I could have had children with my soulmate. But your soulmate is coming in. The true one is coming in, Bibbil. Uh, there is a lot of encouragement in the cards today. And it's almost saying if you never had children because you were looking for a soulmate, you will have children with your soulmate if that's what you want. And if you had children with someone who you uh, find uh, revolting right now, uh, who is a douche flute? I mean, it happens, right? I feel like you feel, oh my God, if only I had children with someone less douche flutey, it's okay. That's, you know, it, whatever, it's their karma. There's nothing to worry about because your ch children are, gold, are golden and beautiful. Uh, so no regrets here, Scorpio, but I think you've been on this quest and there were many false soulmates on the path to uh, your love success, Bibbio. And you're coming into your own right now, your karma. What you're not expecting is the justice card. Your ca karma is coming up for you. Libra got a similar feel to their reading today. So your karma is coming through for you. No more twad waffles. By the way, thank you to one of my blue angels for suggesting twad waffles. Like, I love that. Yeah, this is like definitely coming into the vocabulary. Douche flute twad waffle. You're not eating no waffles no more. We're gluten free, but Bill, okay? We're kosher, we're halal, we're gluten free, sugar free. Uh, no more waffles. Uh, this person is going to be someone new is coming in, okay? And this is going to be your justice. This is your karma. This is the quest you've been on here, okay? <sighs> You've been told many times before, Scorpio, don't hold out for the, for the one, like it's bullshit, like whatever. Oh, I said bullshit, whatever. Okay, so we're swearing today. It is the full moon. I, what can I say? Um, Scorpio, you know how it goes uh, at Blue Angel Love Tarot. It's all a little bit. Uh, yeah, people have been telling you, give up the quest, it doesn't exist, true love doesn't exist, you know, whatever. Like, this is, char this is a childish dream. Um, but you've retained your beautiful innocence, and you're cutting yourself off from the past. So someone who hurt you recently, someone hurt you recently, uh, or the most recent person who hurt you, it took a while to get over them, maybe, because Scorpio takes a while to get over things, but once we get over it, you're dead to us. So, you know, I feel like someone... Someone was kind of living rent free in your mind a little bit, and you're just coming. Oops, <laughs> did you see that? I just upset my little halo. And you're just coming into this energy of just going, okay, twad waffle, that's it, snippity snip. And uh, you're not re really not expecting how quickly your karma will come back around to you in a positive way. And all the work you did on yourself, all the rejections you, you it's like you've been rejecting a lot of trashy offers, you know? Or maybe people have rejected you. If people have rejected you in the past, people, it's because it's the hand of the angels. It's almost like the hand of the universe of God, uh, making sure to get these uh, douche flutes out of your way, baby, all right? The justice card beautiful like your karma is coming in you don't even know how quickly that's going to come back around uh there's another little warning here a lot of bibbies are getting this it's mercury retrograde baby i think it's almost been in every reading there is something from the past still lingering nine of swords and i don't think it's you i think it's your person from the past someone in the past who still thinks about you can't sleep at night because of you and they're tortured almost by you know the things they did all the things they could have done uh you could still be feeling this is maybe the one that you're cutting yourself off from i'm pretty sure it is actually uh you know whatever this thing was that caused you sadness that first card we got in the reading the five of um cups you know someone caused you sadness and disappointment uh could have been a long time we were getting over this you know uh, maybe since gemini season it could be, could be a full month or a full year you've been getting over someone baby but you're ready. You're ready for something new. And uh, this person is not over you. Something could have happened in September uh, 21 last year. 
and the energy is still lingering. So be careful with Mercury retrograde because that's when these twad waffles, they twad all the way, twad waffle all the way back to you. You know what I'm saying? They're gonna twad waffle their way into your life. So, you know, be vigilant. Uh, you got the Knight of Pentacles, a new offer, a new love. Someone who's gonna put their money where their mouth is. That pr a prince, princess, anyone in between you've been dreaming of since you were a little bibu, here they are. Okay, your fairy tale come true. This is your knight in shining armor, princess in shining armor, uh, on a beautiful, beautiful horsey here. Someone's coming towards you. It's going to be amazing energy. Let me just clarify some of this new energy here. It's time to let go of the past, baby. It's time to move forward. The past is still lingering, though. It still has its little talons in you. I feel like that person is not over it, but it, you know, bibu, um. Just because they're not over it doesn't mean that you owe them something, baby. Let's see. Please show me angels. Oh, someone who's going to, like, look at this person. They're kneeling before your feet. <laughs> okay. this Someone's coming in. Look, you have a wounded warrior that you're about to meet, okay? And Scorpio loves that kind of energy. You know how it is, Scorpio. We love a little bit of a wounding. We love a little uh, bird with a broken. We love something a little bit different. This is someone with a little bit of spice to them. This is not your regular little bit build. This is not your nine to fiver. This is someone who's been through it. But someone who is in the service of justice, it's either a social justice warrior or a warrior of some kind. Their life has been a bit of a war, a bit of a battle. Scorpio appreciates that. Uh, it's someone who's been in, 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 you know, in in the line of fire. I think it could be an actual soldier or a military person, baby. But tell me more, please, angels, about this. Oh, baby, I'm trying to keep these readings short, but like so many messages are coming through, and the energy today is so potent. And we're just gonna keep going, baby. I'm sorry, I don't mean to like, you know, over over flow you with energy today, King of Pentacles. Okay, Taurus energy here. All right, could be a Taurus. Uh, could be uh, a, a, another a grounded earth sign. Doesn't have to be. Doesn't have to be e even in their chart. It's just the aura of someone who is very grounded, very, um, very stable, very much about giving you support. The King and the Knight of Pentacles in one reading here. Okay, this is definitely some kind of a soldier. Uh, your little foot, foot soldier, you know, like it's going to be your little, mm, you know, if this is someone who's going to be protective of you. Uh, whether it's a girl, boy, anyone in between, it's just the feel of someone who's always going to have your back. Maybe it's another Scorpio, too. Uh, take these messages as they resonate. It is a general reading on the internet, and I am just a, a random person with an inflatable alien, so, you know, take it with a pinch of salt as well. But someone is coming in. Uh, between now and Capricorn season, someone is coming to get you, baby. <laughs> someone's coming to get you, baby, Scorpio. Someone's going to be like, mm, Scorpio. They're going to chase you. You're going to maybe hide under a rock. Don't hide, baby. Accept this person. Accept their love. Um, Bibi, Scorpio, I'm not going to lie. There's a lot of drama in the Scorpio life always. I feel like for the first time, you're going to meet someone who's not drama. Someone who's not going to make it hard for you. Someone who's not going to play games. Someone who's not going to be perfect in the first five minutes and then change up on you. It's just a stable uh Mm, honest energy you know the goddess rejoices when she sees something like this yeah look you got the six of wands there's a lot of like victorious military feel to this person if they're not a warrior of some kind i feel like they could be in the public eye as well uh so you know take these messages as messages as they resonate but their money is good they're very stable they're very open they're looking for a soulmate whatever you've been looking for they're looking for the same thing but bill so mm, mm, mm. Oh my god, this is amazing energy, baby. Oh, Scorpio, I'm so happy for you, baby. Let me know in the comments below if this is your journey, if this is your story. Uh, also, shout out to Gondora official as usual. I forgot in all this like uh, Mercury retrograde clamor. If you don't know Angie, uh, get with the program, Scorpio, because she is an amazing Scorpio reader, and uh, her channel is linked in the description box below. I love my sister so much. She is my sister. Go tell her I love her. If you see this, tell her happy uh, Mercury retrograde and happy full moon. Um, she has videos daily, so uh, if my messages don't resonate, you can always go check her out. We'll have another one today. Later this evening, you're going to get you versus them, boo, boo I'll see you next time, my darling. Um, don't forget to like the video because it really helps me out as a small creator on YouTube. Subscribe to the channel, too. And if you want to get a personal reading with me, uh, all the information is down below. I'll see you, well, this evening. <laughs> I'm sorry, Scrooge, I'm so discombobulated. I'll see you this evening. I really missed you, boo, -boo. Um... I love you, stay sparkly, stay moisturized, and may the angels protect you. <laughs>